Hello everyone, welcome. Sorry, saw my hand there. Welcome to Dalton and Lee's Weekend Adventures. And of course, Dalton's not here right now. We're at a cemetery here in Statesville, North Carolina. Don't know if this has anything to do with the Statesville. Uh, I mean, the cemetery or not, but I just wanted to show it. See if I can zoom in on this. James Hill. So I've not made it into the cemetery that I'm at. Pretty flowers, by the way. I'll step back so you can see this little monument here. Pretty nice. The, the graveyard I'm going to is right behind here. So that's where I'm heading now. So let's get at it. Please bear with me with the noise cars and the wind is blowing so hopefully you can hear me one of these days I'll upgrade and get a better audio equipment but this is another installment of Leno problems graveyard adventures while we had it we I can find the plane here Back side of what I just showed you. We're going to be doing a lot of stuff out here in the states of North Carolina because there's a lot of history out here. So, once again, let's go to it. I really don't know what that building right there is, but we're going to check it out. I don't know if I have time today or not, but we'll definitely look into it and see what it is. Another look at the cemetery we're getting ready to go into. Congressman buried out here, so we'll go check and see if we can find him. Of course, once again, another big cemetery, old cemetery that has all this beautiful rock wall. Looks like it's been here for years. This is one of them type of graveyards you see in movies and stuff. That's a pretty cool looking tree. But let's get at it, guys and girls. Let's get in there. That is a church, I believe. Beautiful church. I hear some music coming out of there. I can't make out the sign, I'm about blind. Something about these old trees and graveyards kind of fascinates me. These beautiful brick walls, or not brick, excuse me, stone rock walls. One of the fancy gates. There's their business hours if anybody ever wants to come out and check it out. Nice shady. Nice, beautiful. So like I said, it is a congressman and a bunch of other people buried out here. We're going to see if we can find that old congressman. gonna find the congressman's out here or not these great arms are pretty old once again a pretty old tree bear with me with the sound sometimes when cars are passing through there was a couple other people in his graveyard right now so I'm trying to stay away from them so they can 
look and do what they need to do while I'm looking for the congressman. A lot of tombstones like this out here. I don't know if it eventually fell over and they decided to put these cement around them to keep people from taking them or what. But they like that a lot over here. As you can see, this place is very shaded by the way. Look at the beautiful work on that. That's awesome. As you can see, you can hear the train. Well, there's showing detail about the wall being built. Sorry, my hand's not as steady as it used to be, but I'm trying my best. 1934. Of course, they keep this gate locked. Pretty nice wall and gate, like I said. This is a very, very beautiful old cemetery. It's shaded real good, so it's extremely a hot day today, but he couldn't tell it under these nice trees. Some of the tombstones are pretty fancy. Now I'll shoot here. I'll tell you the artwork that goes in some of these are amazing if someone knows how to do all that I wish I could learn how to do all that that'd be awesome I mean I love the draw of course that one looks like it's been moved so hopefully they don't fall off there and break because that would not be good I wish uh, someone could put that back into place I'm strong, but I ain't that strong to do it by myself, and I wouldn't attempt to do it myself. Once again, it's another. Of course, right here is the name of the congressman and judge name we're looking for on here Andrew so I'm trying to find him I know funeral homes can be sad at times, but is there any need for people to throw beer and liquor bottles in a place that people has earned the right to be buried at, to be honored? 
mean, this is a pretty cemetery. There's that big, beautiful tree. And under this bush, next to these military men and women, there have to be one of these out here. Man, I tell you, nobody has no respect. Pretty cool looking bench type seat built there. Pretty awesome. I don't know if it's the comfortable thing in the world, but it does the purpose. Bear with me, trying this selfie stick out. Well, I'm sitting on this trusty old chair here, or they built years and years ago. It's pretty comfortable, somewhat. Got a little padding on here. It'd be real great. Oh man, well, pretty cool. But anywho, still haven't found the congressman yet. Hope y'all can see me, because you know I got this thing inverted a different way. Uh, but real nice out here. I just wish people would show people respect. And don't worry, I'm gonna pick up an old liquor bottle in that old trash bag right there. And a few other trash cigarette butts, caps. I wanna tidy up a little bit here, even though it ain't my place, but I don't like disrespecting graveyards. I mean, I understand you gotta bring something out here to trench your thirst, maybe a little cheap notes but all that always goes back on me and ends up in the trash can so just remember this guys the girls who's out here in these graveyards or passing these graveyards and decides to throw a liquor bottle and all that one of these days it's going to be you laying in here and someone's going to disrespect disrespect your grave just think about that now i know a lot of you probably don't care for my graveyard adventure videos but I do. It's something I like doing. I'm going to keep doing it. But I hope you enjoy them. I try to put down their different stuff. This season we've got a lot of new stuff going on. Like I said, Dalton Big Boy Adventures. We've got some, you know, we're doing the Dalton and, and Lee uh, Weekend Adventure Blog, which I'm doing currently right now. I'm doing two things at one time. Dalton's not with me. I figure it's the best time to come out here and film this old graveyard. Try to find our congressman and show respect to the other men and women who's out here. Um, so, if you got any more ideas for the graveyards or for Dalton Big Boy Adventures or the weekend adventures, which you know, we got several Comic Cons coming up. If you didn't see the one set of Comic Con videos, go check them out. Please share, like, subscribe to me, comment on the bottom of my video saying you subscribe, and I'll subscribe back, and all that good stuff. So, let's see if we can uh, find some more awesome stuff out here and see if we can find this congressman. Bear with me. Might get a little shaky taking this thing down. And again, um, also, uh, noise, cars passing by, motorcycles, and the wind. This phone that I'm filming with, because I'm still s trying to save money to get a new camera. Don't have the best microphone to wear, but I am working on getting the microphone for this thing and a, and a sweet little setup. So this, you know, this takes time, guys, but this is my passion to put down the YouTube videos. And I'm gonna keep doing it as long as God will let me do it. And uh, so, there you go. Uh, sorry for the shaking again. All right, guys, bear with me. I'm gonna leave it on this little selfie stick. And hope these piss ants and these bugs don't eat me away. 
course I used to have a real steady hand at filming things but got old got car tunnel other problems just like most people now I see something in the tree here I don't know if it's a camera a deer camera or what it is yes it's a camera out here that's pretty cool huh sorry for the shaking but it's like a little hunting or deer camera or something they must like seeing the birds and the squirrels and maybe other animals that comes out here or maybe they use that to see if people's out here trashing the place hey you gotta do what you gotta do so bear with me once again I'm gonna stretch this thing out see if I can get a bird's eye view of everything so bear with me y'all seeing one of these days if I ever get lucky I'm gonna invest in one of them fancy little doodad helicopters or trones or whatever you want to call them I can't say that word so I'm old country boy oops sorry for the shaking once again so let's go see if we can get back at finding this congressman well I noticed this has got a little brick walkway does it lead to something special or is it just for looks i don't know oh you see my shadow hey guys another gate by the way if you want to come out to this place i will have the address the name of this cemetery on the details uh but i tell you i couldn't find no parking so i don't know if i was supposed to or not but i parked down at the cbs Shh, don't tell nobody Again, I love these big old trees. All right, well, I'm gonna go see where this sidewalk or rockway ends up. The bush needs to be trimmed. Yeah, the walk around, be careful right there. Another big, beautiful tree. But still no congressman. But I'm still hunting. I about slipped on these little balls, but it's a pretty cool tombstone. And I noticed these right here has a little cement or little stone edges. So maybe he's in this part of the world. Who knows? I'm going to walk by and just check it out. I've, I know he's got a tombstone about like this. I have seen pictures of it. So, we're looking for him still, guys. We'll find him. If nothing else, at least we got a beautiful scenery here on this beautiful day.
sun's starting to come out. Well, actually, the sun's been out, but I've just been out of the out of it for a little bit. Like I said, it's not a real big cemetery, but it's spread out pretty decent. Of course, more another fancy chair with more trash on it. People, I tell you, they make me sick sometimes. see you there sorry about that I was wondering where I laid you at hope you guys are okay out there but again we're still out here hunting it down hunting it down still pretty out here though now I may have to for YouTube I don't know um, right now I know I'm at 23 minutes and I still got half of this to walk so this may be a two-part series so this may be the point where i have to split it i don't know and this could end up being a three-part series right now it's enough to make it a two-part series but uh bear with me so this may be a full-length video i don't know what i'm gonna do with it because it takes so long to get videos up when it's long so this may be cut down to two to three-part series but who knows Pretty little old uh, shack or building or some type. Don't know what it is, but it looks pretty cool. Hope y'all can read this. It's awful bright out here. I'm still walking this walk path and I still haven't 
come across the senator but these tombstones are so old that they hard to read the names I know if you're fine grave.com has a picture of the grave tombstone and I am you know, a member of that group or that website you should all check it out you can find a lot of people in there celebrities and non-celebrities but even if I don't find a congressman out here today this is tr a, a, a wonderful sight to see and had fun out here and uh, it just gives me another reason to come back out here uh, I have to go back to findagrave.com maybe they'll have the area because I noticed some of these areas some of these places does have little numbers on them so maybe if I can find the exact number I can get closer to finding them but I still got quite a bit to find look true Hello, back to see my ugly face. <laughs> oh, hopefully I didn't hit nothing that's gonna screw the volume up or anything like that. Sorry about that. Bear with me again. I'm stretching you back out and I'm sweating pretty good. Alright, I've walked this whole cemetery. Uh, he's out here. I'll probably just walk right over his grave. But these tombstones are very, very hard to read. So, but... I had fun out here. Um, I will, uh, what I'm gonna do when I end this video is cause you know my phone I'm using so I can't just doo doo up stuff cause I'm filming. Uh, Google up or search. I'm gonna as soon as I end this broadcast. This broadcast. I'm so used to broadcasting on live dot me. But as soon as I end this video, I'm going to go to live. I mean uh, to uh, <coughs> findagrave.com and see if I can get the order the numbers that he's supposed to be at. And if I can get a number, I'll walk around and find the numbers. And then if I find it, I will film it and put it on there. So this might be a three-part series with a bonus footage if I find the congressman. But I'm not going to give up. If I have to come back, I will another date. But it is some other stuff here in the States from North Carolina. I like to film today. So uh, I can't spend too much more time here in this beautiful cemetery as much as I love to. And I'm going to see if I can stretch this back the way you can see the actual cemetery instead of my ugly old mug. Stretch you out as far as I can stretch you. Once again, it's a beautiful, beautiful cemetery. Hope y'all can hear me way up there. But it was very, very beautiful here. Need to say, uh, I will put a name of this cemetery. Uh, on the details uh, for some odd reason I forgot what this cemetery is called because I got dumb timers just bear with me but I hope you enjoy this, this video is about 30 minutes long already so this will probably be a three part series if I look up and get the details and find the, uh, the congressman's grave I will make it a fourth part a bonus part but for right now I'm going to end this one right here. I hope you enjoy this video. Please share, like, comment. If you uh, subscribe, please comment on the bottom saying I subscribe and I'll subscribe back. Got any ideas for me for any more grave sightings or for big Dalton boy, Dalton big boy adventures or got any ideas for any other videos that matter in a with the things that you think will be awesome for me to film here. In the Piedmont Triad, the foothills, the mountains, North Carolina, Virginia, wherever. And uh, looking forward to filming some more Comic Cons in a couple months ahead. Got Hero Con coming up in, uh, in, uh, in June, in July. It's a Comic Con right here in Statesville, believe it or not. 
the stage will Comic Con will be right here. I'll be going to find the location of that. It's the stage will I think um, don't want to tell you wrong on it, but I think it's the Civil War Center or Silver something. I'll have to look it up. But anywho, I hope to see y'all there again. Bear with me. Um, and this has been fun again. Thank y'all again. God bless y'all. Hope y'all have a wonderful one. And uh, stay tuned. And please, not everything I do is gonna please everyone, but I try to put different kind of contents out there. I've been on YouTube nine years come June 24th. Nine years is a long time. My first ever video I put on here was the demolition of the Demon Dinkin Tower, which I did a little promo, a little, you know, memory lane type video a couple days ago I released. Now I filmed that and um, about a year, year and a half before I even was on YouTube. So, but nine years ago that was my first video. My second video. I filmed uh, Heather Cox from American Idol and my uncle's Donnie's ice cream truck right there in Yakinville, North Carolina, and then a bunch of wrestling videos. Uh, we got all kinds of videos on Lead No Problem videos. Check them out. Not everything is going to please everyone, but uh, hopefully all the new material I'm doing is pretty cool. I did film a car show earlier, so uh, I'll have it up if the footage looked good. I kind of did it in a rush fashion, so I don't know how it's going to look. But just bear with me. Like I said, got any ideas? Got anything we should? You think I should do for Dalton Big Boy Adventures? I'm looking for all kinds of stuff for him to do. So got any ideas for that? Let me know. Once again, thank you. God bless you. And if I see and find a congressman, it'll be a part four to this video. If not, enjoy these three-part series.